The ash, the hoe we tapping and pass it like magic. No, we not asking, we see it, we grabbing. Diamonds, they flashing, go blind when I'm passing. Mask on, I'm clapping, no mask on assassin. Jugging, we snatching, all black is the fashion. We not the same, bro, just look at the fabric. Hey, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Kama. We back with another video, man. Hey, man, real quick. Um, um Cowboys come up a tough loss this Sunday. Has. Past Sunday versus the Packers, man. We fall 31 28 overtime, hard fought game. Um, I haven't been right. I haven't made a video in a few days dealing with personal stuff, but you know, I'm back. So, Cowboys lose. Who do I put this loss on, right? I think the defense has to take accountability for. But, like, this loss, right? Um, Dak had two picks in this game. But also, we had a 14-point lead in the fourth quarter with a team with a questionable receiver core. Questionable, like, a five-game loser streak. But ultimately, ultimately, I think in the NFL, people go too far off narratives, right? And it's like, they lost five games in a row. Did we not think that they was going to come? A desperate team is a dangerous team. Did we not think that they was going to be desperate and come out and pull out all the stops to beat us? I, I wasn't shocked that this was a um, close game because it's Aaron Rodgers, man. People got pride. Green Bay is a talented team. They just been underachieving this year. So it was like, I wasn't shocked by that. But um, we did, bottom line, man, we just got to get better. Um, hopefully. We get Anthony Barr back. I see a lot of Cowboys kind of this shit on Anthony Barr. I mean, it has to look the same without him. I mean, we hope we get Zeke back this week. Um, I mean, it's it can only it can only make us better. It can't make us worse. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. Um, I'm not going to talk about the Odell situation. Um, but the Eagles took their first L to the Washington Commanders. Um, I'd be lying if I said it was shocking because the signs were there for the Eagles and their run defense and their lack, their their lack of scoring in the second half of games. But even though a lot of the Eagles fans would equate that to me blowing you out, so we don't have to play the second half. But um, a game just passed if you had to play the second half, and Washington were clearly was clearly the better team out there. Um, I'm hearing Dallas Goddard went out. He's gonna miss some extended period of time. I mean, but this is part of uh, Devontae Maddox is on IR, um, Jordan Davis is on IR. But this is this is what I always say is the NFL, man. It's all about it's not about who starts off the most healthiest and who's more explosive. You're going to have to face adversity going to the NFL season. Everybody else is to face it. Um, Washington in the division. Washington has been decimated by injuries. We have had a ton of injuries that we've been seeming to overcome um, for the most part. Giants have had a ton of injuries that they seem to be overcoming with a 7-2 record. I mean, the Eagles, they're just going through a little adversity with a uh, um, coach team, playing the coach team next week that seems to be high up right now because they got a new coach, a new energy. Matt Ryan's just starting running back. Um, John the coming off a big game. Uh, we play the Vikings. Um, I think this would be a big statement when we come out and get this job done. I believe we can beat the Vikings. I just believe we match up well with the Vikings. Um, yeah, let's just get back on track, man. We're going to look back, look in the past. Aaron Rodgers does it to us again, man. What can I say? But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, though. Always remember, like, and subscribe. It's a great comment. Salute.